Hey folks, Daily Lance Blog, good to see you. It's, uh, it's the weekend and I hope for you that you go, you know what, I don't care if it's the weekend. I felt good yesterday, I feel good today. Uh, for those of us that have had days when we have really struggled, uh, at a certain point you go, I don't, I don't care what day of the week it is, I just want to feel good. And I have a couple of friends, a couple of buddies, uh, guys that, that you know, people that you know, who are really struggling right now and it reminded me of something that is such a such an important lesson that I have learned from this and that is that the illness of depression has a voice it speaks to you it talks to you and it tells you things about yourself that you would never believe if you were mentally healthy at that time it tells you all of these things and one of the things it tells you is you will never get better that you are worthless and I keep hearing this over and over again and it's well wait a second here uh, that, that was a what was beeps wasn't it case what? what does that mean does that mean that there's something ready in the oven I think, so. I think maybe it does okay so why don't you move over there and I'll just put these these uh, these items from the oven uh, down over there oh they look really really good be confident in your back here I am so what I was saying was that this illness that we talk about and that many of us have suffered from has has this this voice and this ability to get inside our heads which I guess makes sense because that's where it lives but it understands us it understands our weaknesses where we're vulnerable and because it knows that it's able to tell us all of the things that absolutely devastate us so I was talking to one friend a young guy was saying you know I'm a zero today and here, this is a guy who's been a zero before but made it back to a pretty good place and I'm telling him, well, you will make it back again because you've done this repeatedly. And he says, well, I, I don't think I will. And I have accomplished nothing in my life. And I say, well, when we spoke a week ago and two weeks ago, you were talking about how you, you felt like you were really on the right track and that you were doing positive things. What happened to those? He goes, well, I, I, I can't see it that way. It, it's, it's like you are brainwashed into seeing yourself in a way that you would never see yourself when you're healthy and that's why you need people around you telling you don't forget this is your illness speaking and while you maybe can't shut it up you don't have to pay attention to it now when I tell you stuff it's not because I think it's easy it's not because I could necessarily do it but I know it's the right thing to say and it's the best way to try and beat this sicknotweak.com we're here 24 hours a day we're here 364 days a year and we are here to remind you that when you think that you are worthless, when you think that people don't care, when you think that where you are right now is where you're always going to be, we're here to tell you, you are wrong. Your illness is lying. Your illness is a lying scumbag son of a bitch. We're here. Case, let her keep rolling. Get a shot of this. I'm not saying what this is. Take that, Chef Jay. That is some really, really good. Cut it now, Case. <laughs>